Is that a new garden you got there? Yep. Are you gonna stay for long? Well, that depends. There any reason for me to stick around? Man, Triffy, I'm sorry. I've been a dang fool. Yep. It's just, I can't grow much out in that desert. Yeah, and you got a lot of growing to do. I wasn't gonna give up my dig site either. We may have different goals sometimes, and we may not be in the same place, but that doesn't mean we're not together. I guess I could leave my farm every now and again and come see your dig site. Uh, maybe even lend a helping paw? You better. Now give me a kiss, you hot dish. Gladly. Mm. Welcome home, Triffy. I just hope the cactus doesn't get jealous. What's it now? Nothing. Oh, sure. Sounds like a real hoot. Oh, I go digging up bits of history and try to piece them back together. It's usually not so dramatic. Just an old coin or a severed toe under a rock. But this island's chock... Oh, goodness, my name! I'm Triffany Lottablog. I heard about the trip to Snack Tooth and thought, well, I could keep scraping at odds and ends till the day I die. Or I could really get out there, try following in Grandma's footsteps. You might have heard of Bronica Lottablog, an adventuring type just like Lisbert. She filled up our old house with relics and sketches, taught me to love history, bless her heart. Amazing, don't you think? We got paintings of bug snacks from a thousand years ago. Grumpus civilization rises, collapses, and turns to dust. But the bug snacks, they always stay. They are walking records of history. It's less I left and more I stopped coming back. I wasn't even there when the fight broke out. Imagine me coming home to find Wambus all red in the face and at Ramble's throat. No, no, nothing so simple as that. I wanted him to come with me to the ruins, honest. But he wouldn't give up his farm, not even for me. <laughs> Stubborn fool. Lovely gal, that Lisbert. Wasn't often we'd both be in town at the same time. And when we were, we'd usually be in the medical tent, getting treated by Agabel. We'd swap stories about what we found and show off our grisliest scars. Adventuring is a dangerous business. Archaeology less so, but the Lottablog method can be unconventional. Bug the heck out of Agabel. She never liked to see anyone hurt. Least of all, Liz. You know, out here, it's only a matter of time before you fall in a hole or get wedged in a crevice. Especially with all these earthquakes shifting the geography around. Not to be morbid, but it could be a thousand years before somebody finds where Lisbert wound up. Oh, you're too kind. I'm just happy to chip in and solve a mystery or two. Speaking of mysteries... You betcha! Lisbert stashed a journal in the ruins for safekeeping. I can't get it open without damaging whatever's inside. I'm thinking you might have better luck with it. Anywho, I've nearly talked your ear off. Better get back to work, eh? Hey, how's the journey? Whoa, 
Oha!
Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Sweet relief. These things better not melt off. Anyway, a deal's a deal, friend. The bridge is yours. Some assembly required. Oh, and so you know, Cromdomart is not responsible for any loss or injury suffered as a result of the use of its products. Hey, if you need anything else, anything at all, please, please, please call your friend Cromdomart. Oh, I'm already sweating. It's too hot. Too hot. Oh, I don't know.